welcome back guys it's good to have you here again so today we want to look at how i made this beautiful travel and tour flyer so without wasting our time let's get started click on the fresh page delete what you have on your screen something like this now the next thing is just to set the background as the image size so you just come to image size here you make it let's say 1080 by 1080 that's 108 1080 by 1350 okay now here is it so this is the size the next thing is under the background let's just select a random color to just fill in the background but i want something that will give us give us a black that will give us that decide to be black so let's use white you can see the other sides are black very good now we just come to come here then come to i want to make use of a particular background so i'll just search for the background in my folder okay here is the here is it so i'll just set it to let's say four by three something like this okay there okay that now spread it over the screen to cover the screen you can see this okay this is beautiful now here i have it good now just come to layer and lock it so as it wants to move again now the next thing that i made use of in this design is to had something like image like a destination that you would like a city itself so i just come to i have something that i've downloaded over time also so i'll just search for it i have it downloaded so here is what i want to make just just okay that bring it to the screen increase the size to fit increase the size to fit onto the screen something like this let me reduce it a little okay i want it to just fit right into the screen something like this you can see that okay good now i have it this is what i really want to have the next thing is to lock this one as well so as it wants to move again so the next thing i did was just to add the let's say text and you come here travel travel worldwide worldwide okay here is the text that i made use of let me make it a capital letter okay now you just come to font and select the fancy font so since it's a travel and tour design, I made use of a very fancy font. Let me see if I can get that particular font. Okay, I think it's this one. Okay, that's it. But this is, let's go back to edit and make it small letter. Make them small letter. Okay. All right, just like that okay that now this is how i got the fancy text that i made use of so you just come to paddling some parts are not showing very well you can just paddle to the right a little paddle to the right right paddling also so just place that somewhere here okay position it at the center just like that okay the next thing is to type in another text which is tourism tourism just like that this one you make it capital letter okay just bring it down here increase the size now let's get a very good font like a bold font because this is the real message that we want to pass across tourism so you just come to font here and look for a very bold bold font that will fit the one that i made use of something like this or this one I can't really tell I think it's this one that I made use of like this 
I don't really know. I just okay. So here is it. You can increase the size. Alignment is important also. So let's change the colors. You can see like the colors. You can make the colors totally black. Black color. You can see. Okay. I'll make this one also completely black color. Okay, great. Now here we have it. The next thing is to start setting the let's say the images of whatever image like giving them a futuristic image so you just add some image to it i have some image that i've downloaded over time so here is one what i just did is to reduce the size of this just rotate it a little something like this rotate it a little reduce the size like this something like this and just duplicate that rotate the other way around like this something like this okay and yeah the next thing i added another image Here is it. Here's the image. Just one to one. Bring it out a little, something like this. Okay, that and just reduce the size. Can reduce the size. This one will be smaller. So just place it. You can bring any of the ones behind. You can bring them to the front to create a kind of a stylish pattern, something like this. You can see this. Now the next thing I did in this design was just to come to. I needed something to cover up the downside so I just have some things that I've downloaded before I just came searching so I just search for clouds here is a particular one that I made use of okay so I just brought this in something like this reduce the size you can see this now I all I did was just to bring this back a little then bring the image that's the buildings just bring it to the front to the front so as the cloud will go back the images will go back you can see the pattern it gave me which is very good and the next thing is to make this design really complete i added um, something like a, like an airplane like a aeroplane so i just have lots of them that I downloaded over time. It can be anyone. This is not the one that I really made use of, or it can be anything at all. So you can get it from anywhere you feel like it's okay. Like this one now. If this was what I really made use of in that design, I could have just made this one like the airplane to form the eye. You can see that tourism, something like this something like this so that be really beautiful so you can see that this is beautiful so you can just get any airplane that will suit your design part time and make use of it so this is how you can easily make it to be beautiful and yeah if i want to do this now i can just go on and edit the tourism and remove the letter i and this wing of the airplane gets to form the eye that's the letter I in the design. So that's how I just did it. And the, yeah, that's how I made the combination of everything, the arrangement. The next thing is just to add some informations, some information. So here you can just make this one, the radius of this, something like this, maybe 40%. It's okay. Then giving it a color. So you can just give it some color. So you just come to color okay that then i got the color that i made use of i just came here and out of these images that i have i just selected something random color here okay that and yeah that's how i got the color uh okay there for it to not to block them uh, the building i just reduce the opacity a little let's say something like this and yeah this is how i got this is how I got the color that I made use of in the design. Just like that. 
and then I think I gave it I don't know if I I'm not sure I remember but you can just do something like this then ensure your your design is properly aligned so just place it somewhere here the next thing is just to input some text like a way of contact or something so let's just type in text you come to text edit it and then you type in let's see okay i have some i think i copied the text from the previous one here they are so i'll just that can make this one a capital letter so these are like the area of focus for our destination travels and all of that so you can increase the size back bring this one in here then come to font and select a very good font for this design for this text font okay so you just come to font something a little bit stylish and bold just like that this is what i made use of so you can increase back let's lock this one i don't like this so you just increase the size of this remember you can always use the size icon you don't always have to use your hand all the time so you can make this one something like this okay 28 if you like you can make it 30 so try and arrange it to the center like this something like this just okay that then you come to color and let's make it white color let's make it white color so as it can be clear to see you can see that and it's very clear the next thing is just to type in the other words i did that just click on this then i'll remove this cut this out okay Okay, that and just reduce the size so reduce the size the size icon you can reduce the size like this something like this can see that Let's increase it further so you just arrange it properly give it the same color like white color also okay just okay that then let me duplicate that just duplicate that bring it to the down I say this is the down Check out our various packages, Europe and Europe, Africa, Asia. Now, the next thing is just to edit this one. Okay. So, if you are designing for a client, they already have a message that they want to pass across. So, yours is just to receive the message, like collect the message from them and just strategically position them like this or in a different style or you can see so this is how i made this beautiful travel and tour design without any stress then if you have let's say you want to add something else like your social media handles you can just create a rectangle small one like this and just bring it down bring it down bring it down something like this okay don't allow it to be too small just a little okay that then you bring this one up a little like this okay this is fine now the next thing is you can just give it like let's say a stroke of let's any color you can make it the same color as the one that is above something like this you can see that and just put whatever you have 
maybe the social media handles you get to arrange them on this white part so that is how to make this simple and beautiful travel laptop thank you for watching if this is your first time or you are a returning subscribe or returning viewer kindly do well to hit the like button and subscribe if this was really helpful to you like and share god bless you